As a luxury sedan, the latest Mercedes-Benz S-Class is pretty great. Effortlessly comfortable as it goes down the road and endlessly luxurious for all of its passengers, there's not a lot Mercedes could do to improve upon this car. But customers, they've never said no to more power. And that's just what AMG has provided with the 2023 S63, packing 791 horsepower via a new plug-in hybrid powertrain. Before we take a look at the 2023 S63, be sure to like, follow, and subscribe to the MotorOne.com YouTube channel and to our channels on all of your favorite social media platforms. And go to MotorOne.com for much more on this vehicle. For the first time ever, the S63 adopts its own unique AMG-specific grill. Take a look at this Panamericana-style grill. It looks fantastic with these vertical strakes. We're getting the Mercedes badge right in the grill. And for the detail-oriented, there is a unique AMG badge on the hood rather than the traditional three-pointed star. Combined with these flared intakes, this is a much more menacing car from the front. Under hood, the S63 retains the S580's twin turbocharged 4.0-liter V8, but complements it with a 13.1 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery pack and a permanently excited electric motor. This is the same basic powertrain found on the GT63 e-Performance with the motor and battery on the back axle and paired with an electronic two-speed gearbox and a limited slip differential. Power is down slightly on the GT63, but with 1,055 pound-feet of torque, the new S63 is no slouch, scampering to 60 in just 3.2 seconds. For reference, that's three-tenths better than the last S63 and is the same time as a Porsche 911 Carrera GTS. That battery pack, developed in conjunction with the folks that build engines for F1 stars Lewis Hamilton and George Russell, gives the rear motor 94 horsepower at all times and up to 188 horsepower in 10-second bursts. Seven drive modes, including a setting that allows the S63 to run on electric power alone, allow drivers to adjust how the V8 gas engine and electric powertrain interact. Those two items work together through an AMG spec 4MATIC all-wheel drive system to keep the S63 pointed straight too. Now, the S63 is a big car. There's no getting around that. But to address this, Mercedes is adding adaptive dampers to the air suspension as standard and it's also including four-wheel steering with up to three degrees of turn. That's not as much as you'll get in a regular non-AMG S-Class, but the addition of the electric motor and battery pack limits just how far this back axle can turn. In addition to that, there are larger brakes and active anti-roll bars to keep everything composed no matter how hard you hustle this big sedan. AMG has made some big, big hardware changes to create the S63, but they shouldn't really come with any drawbacks in terms of refinement. In fact, since this car can run on electric power alone, it might actually be more refined than the current S-Class. There's still a lot we don't know about this car, including how efficient the plug-in hybrid powertrain is and just how much it'll cost. We expect to learn all that and much, much more about the 2023 S63 when it goes on sale near the end of next year.